Okay, we are going to begin by doing gradient map. So with gradient map, you want to work with an image that obviously has some nice color. And we are going to start by creating an adjustment layer down here on our layers palette. And the one that we're going to choose is gradient map. Now, there are other options when you look at gradient maps, some pretty funky options. However, we're going to stick to the nice black and white option, and we're going to say OK. So what that's created over here in our layers map is a nice mask, and the mask is white. So what happens is as long as we're clicked on the mask part and not the layer part, um, we can then go and reveal the underneath color. This is sort of blocking the underneath color level. So if we go over to our paintbrush and we get the black brush, the opposite color of our mask, um, I'm going to want a nice big brush and I'm going to want it to be 100% opaque and I think I want a pretty hard brush. And I'm going to zoom in here and what I'm going to do is paint with that black brush on that mask layer. It won't work if I'm not directly on that mask layer. And I can reduce the size of my brush so I can get it perfect here. Um, and if I want, I can do maybe this stem as well. And then it's just about being careful here, especially along the edges that I've got it all. Now, if I make a mistake, what's nice about working this way with the layer masks is that the what I can do is I can just paint back in the mask. So if I switch back to white, the color of my mask, and I paint with the white brush now on again on the mask, I can make sure that it's truly perfect. I haven't made any mistakes here. I zoom out and I have this cute half color, half black and white image. So the other thing is you don't have to work in 100% opacity. So this time I'm going to reduce it down to about 10%. And I'm also going to make my brush a little bit softer. And I'm going to make it way bigger to about the size of my apple. And I'm just going to hit it once. Oh, but I need to switch back to black because I'm revealing my mask. I'm just going to click it once. And what that's going to do is just slowly bring back the color. I'm going to hit it twice. So that's 20% now of color back in on the apple and then 100% back in on the leaf. And that's the end.